Hey everyone, it's Charlie with FPP Shorts here. I recently upgraded x lights and I am on 2022.22. It's currently November 8th today, so this is the most recent version. And it looks like now you can actually add your master FPP controller to x lights Here I have my master FPP controller. It's the same as adding any other FPP controller. Just click Add Ethernet. It'll give you a new controller here. You can go over to the right side after you click on it, give it a name, and then under vendor, you would choose FPP like normal. And But for model, there's a couple of updates here. There is FPP video playing remote only and FPP player only option. If you don't do any video output from your master, you'd want to choose the player only. If you're playing videos with that FPP device, then you would obviously want to choose video playing remote. Since I don't have any capes or anything on my master that output to lights, I'm going to click player only. I put it as X lights only. I could probably leave it as inactive, but being that this is fairly new, I want to see how X lights only works for this. Then you would put in your controller's IP address. And now you can see that it's online. You can open it directly here. And really it's just kind of a little more transparent about all your controllers and everything you got going on with your show. And then when you use FPP connect now on your master controller, you actually have a pixel hat or cape option. I know there's a lot of confusion for some people that you don't put your master inside of X lights, even though if you click discover, it'll find it that can trip a lot of people up. And hopefully this helps make animated lighting displays even easier for everyone. If you learned anything from this quick video, give the video a thumbs up, consider subscribing to FPP shorts, and I'll have a lot more tips, tricks, and tutorials coming out soon.